Hi everybody, it's Ginger Fire. I'm your regular Monday host for Starting Out Solitary. And this week, our topic is Scott Glad. Skyclad. I... It is not in my wheelhouse, per se. Um, to say this for sure, I think Gerald Gardner coined the term skyclad. Um, in essence, it is performing your rituals or worship or what have you, sans clothing, naked. Um, I personally think that human beings for thousands of years in all likelihood have performed some sort of rites or worship, um, healing, something like that, um, without clothing. It, it, I don't think we've always had the same hang-ups that we do now regarding the naked form. Now the question as to whether I do, I would, um, that, that changes. Um, I have, I'm a solitary practitioner, so, you know, it, it doesn't, you know, it doesn't affect me in, in any way that, you know, I would feel embarrassed or anything like that. I mean, I'm in the privacy of my own home doing my own thing, you know what I mean? And um, it actually just happened because I had, I was, I was going to do, um, it was either a ritual or a, a working of some sort. And I'd had, you know, like a nice cleansing bath and I had my bathrobe on and you know, I'm in circle doing my thing and, you know, like, let's face it, like I'm in my fifties, hot flashes come and go. It, it's just the nature of where I am on my life path right now on my road. So, you know, I was all by myself off came the robe. I did the rest of the ritual naked. I'm cool with that. It's my bod, you know? Um, is that something that I just go ahead and do on a regular basis? No. It's not that I don't, it's not that I don't see value in it. Um, I do actually, in the same way that I see value in um, connecting with the earth in my bare feet. There is a, um, a freedom and a connectedness that I think um, we don't always feel when we are barriered off. Do I think that it affects my practice in any way because I don't, I don't practice Skyclad? No, no. Um, I think it would probably be the uh, nice to do. I don't think that it's something that I have to do, if that makes any sense at all. Um, and I was, while I was thinking about the, this topic, I was thinking, you know, cause I, I do occasionally go to a, go to a goddess circle. Um, there's an open coven here in Toronto and I do attend infrequently, but I do attend. And, um, it's, it's all women, hence the term goddess circle. And I, I thought to myself, you know, <clears throat> would, if that, if that circle was conducted skyclad, would that affect whether I went or not? I don't think it would probably because it is women and yeah I think probably probably just because it is women 
So have I? Yes. Would I again? Yeah, maybe. I think it would depend on my mood, what I was working, where I was. Um, I don't think it's a necessity. It's certainly not a necessity in my practice. I would like to hear what all of you guys think. Do you? Would you? Could you? Have a great week. I'll see you next week. Bye.